This is the installation instruction for the Trex Rainscape product. This will be for if you do have flashing up against your house. There's all different types of flashing. The one we're showing here is a 3 inch by 3 inch L flashing, meaning there's 3 inches that goes up behind the wall, goes down an L, and then it's 3 inches out over the ledger board and over part of the joist. The best and easiest way to install our system is to slide our trough material up underneath the flashing. The things that you want to make sure of is that the product actually slides up underneath and sits on top of the flashing. So a lot of times you want to look in there to make sure that it's not in the face of the ledger board. You slide it all the way in so it's sitting on top of the ledger board. Right there. And then you can install the system. Again, all the stapling, stapling patterns. that we show in our installation guide. Repeat the same process over. Checking to make sure again that it's on top of the ledger board. Once that's done, our instructions show to trim off the excess trough material. <clears throat> Making sure that you don't cut through the back side. I always lay it flat, the utility knife flat. Once this is done, I take the Trex Rain Escape Butyl Caulking. And I'm going to run a heavy bead up underneath the flashing material, up over all the joist to make a good tight seal. Once I'm done there, I'll take our trough material, <coughs> or the tape, the tape's going to be run down each one of the joists and it has to cover up the flashing. Another thing to keep in mind is that in some cases your flashing you'll actually have where the flashing actually overlaps depending if you're using a 10, 10 foot stick Wherever the overlap from flashing is, you're going to have to either caulk or tape that to make sure you get a watertight seal. Once you get all the troughs taped together down each of the seams, then we run two inches of the tape, the four inch wide tape, two inches of it goes on top of the, trough, or the flashing, the other two inches goes under the trough material to make a watertight seal. This prevents water from blowing back up underneath itself. You have a good hard rain. Lay it in place. Push it down. 